A machine uprising is definitely taking place on the Tyne, from Arnie's Terminator Cyborg to a robotic Michael Jackson, lost in space to Red Dwarf. This fantastic new display of robots is set to drawing geeks like me. But how did this collection come together? It's actually all owned by one man. It's a private collection. So yeah, we just sourced it the same way we do our regular exhibitions. We tracked it down and decided it was something we wanted to see in Newcastle. There's certain things that everybody loves and we found that robots is one of those things. There's something from every generation that people can identify with and it's been really popular. <laughs> And these iconic metal creatures range from the silliest to the scariest. So what's their appeal? And what do they teach us about real-world advancements? I think there's something about them that captures people's imagination. It's something that is not yet reality, but could be in the future. And I think that's what's exciting about robotics. I think a lot of it is sort of how the idea of robots has changed over the years. We've got ones from sort of the 1940s up to slightly more modern and it's how people's idea of what robotics should look like, how artificial intelligence will be portrayed on the screen has changed over that time and it's really interesting to see. Robotics and artificial intelligence is something that's becoming more prevalent in life and getting to see in any form is something that people find fascinating. I think it's seeing sort of the ones you've seen on screen, the ones you've grown up with such as the Star Wars ones, there's um, Robocop, things like that, it's very interesting to see up close and personal. And with half term just around the corner, there's an even bigger invasion on the way to keep children entertained over the holidays. We've got a lot on for February half term actually, as well as all the robots in the exhibition that you can see, we'll have some special guests. We have some uh, sci-fi cosplayers to be roaming around in full costume, so that should be fun. We have some Daleks coming in to meet and greet people, and we also have some modern robotics in the terms of robots you can interact with, robots you can play with and a robo arena battle, so that should be fun. There's something for all the family and you can come see some of the scariest robots and some of the friendliest robots and see who takes your fancy. Mark Patterson for Made in Thailand Weir and clearly on another world.